Hey there, my tech community. This is Anglish, and I'm here to debug your English. Today, we're talking about English for bug reports. Before we dive into this interesting topic, I would like you to subscribe to this channel so that you don't miss my videos. And also, don't forget about notifications. I want you to be the first one to receive it when I post a new video. What is a bug report? It's a description of what doesn't work and what needs fixing. How to write a good bug report? Well, a good bug report breaks down the bug into a clear step-by-step -step way. Also, you don't make any assumptions when writing your bug report. You don't say, I think, or I, I believe. You have to operate facts only. I have prepared an example of a good bug report, and I would also like to teach you some English for writing good bug reports. Let's go. Number one, when we describe the bug, we typically use passive voice to describe it. For example, the link for setting the user password that is sent upon registration is broken. The link is broken. We don't care who broke the link, or maybe we don't know who broke the link. That is why we use passive voice, is broken. If you include any attachments and you want to describe what they show, use the construction, the attached picture shows, or the attached illustration shows, or the attached file shows. For example, the attached picture shows that the link is sent to the user inbox. Again, we use passive voice. Why? We don't know or we don't care who sends the link. The only thing that we care about to talk about the situation, the link is sent. When in doubt, use the phrase the user, not a user or just user. Use the word user with the article the. This is the most common and grammatically correct option. Also, if you don't know whether the user is he or she, say they or their. For example, the user receives the link and they have to go and do something else. When you describe the steps to reproduce the bug, make sure you use the verb in its infinitive form without to. That's why we say open the web store, begin the account registration, click on the link, etc., etc. Last but not least, a good bug report is this report that is so clear that anyone can reproduce the bug and they don't need to ask questions. Everything is clear from the description. Now I'm curious to know if you've ever written a bug report and considering the information that I have just shared with you, do you think your bug reports were good or not so good? Let me know in the comments. Also, let me know in the comments if this video, if this information was useful for you and if I should make more Tech English videos like this. If you would like to improve your tech English for writing bug reports or user stories or test cases, I would like to invite you to my English for Tech course. I will drop the link to the course that gives you 25% off. Check it out in the description and start improving your IT English with me today.